the biggest lie people tell you about Doom Eternal is that it's really difficult. I mean, fair enough it can be. I don't think I've ever got past the first level on Ultra Nightmare. Because <laughs> I'm rubbish. But it has the widest range of difficulty I've ever seen in a game. Um, I'm happiest on Ultra Violence now, but my first playthrough was on the easiest difficulty. The, the biggest hurdle really is that first level, at least until the car make a boss fight, uh, before you've got most of your weapons and abilities. But there's a ton of extra lives in the first two levels, which max out at, I think about 100. So the only way you're going to die is if you is if you stand in the middle of a fight and do nothing like this <laughs> for about 20 minutes or something. And in level one, you can get the infinite lives cheat, which means you can replay any level you've completed, honing your skills without any fear of dying or losing lives, while still picking up extra lives for the subsequent levels. And that doesn't make it any less fun to play, it's still very, very fun. I think even if you don't like even if you think you don't like games, you'll enjoy it. In, in fact, I think it'll probably spoil most other games for you because you'll be wondering why it's not as enjoyable as Doom Eternal. Uh, this is a public service announcement for people who don't go outside much. Which is most people now because of Covid. <laughs> Fuck you Covid. Uh, but yeah, swings and roundabouts. <laughs>